Hi, Abby. Okay, so your question is, um, you have a certain number of hot dogs, a certain number of pizza rolls. <clears throat> Each of the uh, hot dogs um, has uh, 70 calories. Each of the pizza rolls has 50 calories. We're going to use the uh, letter P to represent the number of pizzas. We're going to use the letter H to represent the number of hot dogs. And they also tell you that you have twice as many hot dogs, uh, twice as many uh, pizza rolls as you have hot dogs. And you have the uh, total number um, of calories is 1190. All right, so let's set up an equation. We're going to do H, which is the number of hot dogs. And since each one has 70 calories, we could just multiply by H to figure out the total number of calories in all the uh, hot dogs. Now, we're going to add that to P, which is the number of pizzas. And since each pizza has 50 calories, we multiply by 50. So if we had three pizzas, then then you would have three times 50, which would be 150 calories for all the pizzas, uh, just for the pizzas. And we know that the total of all the combination of hot dogs and pizzas is equal to 1190. So we set that up um, equal to 1190. Now, they do tell us that there's twice as many uh, pizza rolls as hot dogs. So I'm going to rewrite this as H times 70. But instead of writing P, I'm going to write 2 times H, because I know that I have twice as many hot dogs as pizzas, twice as many pizzas as hot dogs, all right? Multiplied by 50 is equal to 1190. So I have 70 H, 2 times 50, 50 is 100. So I'm going to have 100 times H is equal to 1190. So that's 170 times H is equal to 1190. We divide both sides by 170. And we get H is equal to seven hot dogs, okay? Um, they're not asking, but um, if they did ask for how many pizzas, it would be twice as many, so it would be 14. And luckily, we have a whole number of hot dogs because otherwise, um, you know, we'd have a, a little bit of trouble with the problem. Hope this helps. Bye.